back on site today there's not much going on i don't know how long this video is going to be it might be a short one because just the carpenter is here he's closing off the sides and stuff so they could do the casting on monday just the carpenter is working today finishing up what he has to do we're going to do a little planting we're going to plant these um, yams. They are ready rooting. Look, look at this big root, and this one has this one. It's coming. So we're going to plant these, and one of the avocado seeds that I have. So, guys, it's not going to be much. We have trash to burn. It was too wet yesterday to finish burning trash. Just a little housekeeping around the area uh, while the uh, carpenter finish what he's doing. So, guys, stay tuned. Guys, my little shelter, because we were eating there and little rice and stuff dropped, I don't know. Over there is loaded with ants. Even red biting ants. So you have the lighter. The lighter? Yes. So we're going to burn trash and we gotta try to get rid of these ants somehow. Hold on one second. So over here, man. The um red ants. The biting ants, the red ants. Look at they build a hole. Look at them. Hey. Yeah. Hey, wherever I'm, you stand it, they are dead. They're all over. Your they took off my back. You stepping on them. I stepping on them. Oh, they all had too. The rain brought them up. The rain. So he has to stand on the 
They're everywhere. I don't know. They're all over. It's like a whole colony. Oh man. Jeez. You want this on? You gonna go? Mm -hmm. They're on top of you already? Mm -hmm. <laughs> they all here too? Oh, the all here. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh, let me move. Jeez, all here has ants. How are we going to get rid of these, guys? Tell me how to get rid of these. They're everywhere. Guys, we have an infestation of ants. They're everywhere. They're taking over. I think because we left the trash too long. Because it was raining, the trash was wet. We tried to burn it yesterday. But it was so wet, it wasn't lighting. So now we have a ton of ants everywhere. All over the compound. See, I'm on top bricks because of this. They're everywhere. Guys, the trash is wet, so we can't get it light. I need to figure out where am I going to plant these things now, because I'm afraid the ants eat them before they even grow. These yams. I don't know if over there is a good spot. We gotta make mounds to plant them. So he's trying to light the fire here so they could get rid of the ants. Mm, everywhere. Guys, we have ants everywhere. How can I get rid of them? They're over here. They're under the shelter. They're over there. If you could look good on the ground, they're there. I need something. See, look, they're all here. Look, ants, ants everywhere. I don't know where they come from because it's been raining before and we never had. But now they colonize there. I need a good way to get rid of them. So now I have to move my little office over here under the shade you step on something here We're trying to put fire on the ants. Burn the trash. Because we have so much ants everywhere. I don't know what to do about this ants. Guys. So yesterday I had big con coming up here and now I came back today and no con. And I had the evidence of the cows coming in my property. I know there had to have been something eating my stuff here. Look, everything, look at this con, it's gone, gone. That's the cows. The only thing left here is the okra coming. It's all gone. I know something was eaten on the, the um, cassava. But there is fun, then nobody eat it. Because he don't let the cow go in there. The cow's been in here. Mm, there's a 
Yeah. yeah. They've been in here. You see the tracks? When he come back again, I'm going to talk to him. I'm going to talk to them because... You see the trucks? Everything is gone. We need a fence. We need a gate. All uh, those trees, those bush, I'm glad they eat those, but my plants is gone. Now, should I plant the yams? Should I plant the yams? This is so... So guys, I have no more maize. The cows been in my property. I have to talk to the herder because I had them on camera the other day coming in here. And look at their hoops. I had suspect an animal eating. I thought it was goats because the cows come by here and I don't never see them in here, but I thought it was the goats. Well, apparently it's not goats. What tree is this? This one is growing here naturally. This look like, what is this? Somebody tell me what this is. Is it a weed? Anyway. We were going to plant yams, but now I don't know because if the animals is going to come in and destroy what I plant, I think I need to put a gate before. I didn't want to put a gate now until I am like getting ready to move in, but it's getting really serious here. You know, people are coming around and the animals are coming in. So what I planted, I'm not going to reap any harvest. They ate it. Now, should I plant these yams or not? That's what I came here to do. Oh, my yams will probably not get planted. Guys, I'm sitting here. I am just so sad because all my corn is gone. Something was eaten and I know something was eating it and it's the cows. The last time it had rained, so I couldn't see the footprints. But today I saw them, and I saw them here on the property a day or two ago. So now I have to find a way to block that gate from them coming in here to keep cows and people. <laughs> because now my whole maze con is gone, they ate it all. So today I was going to do some planting of yams. I'm taking them back home. I'm taking them back home until I get a gate here. Why? They have, you know, all this. They have all that maize up there and cassava, but they come in here for my little maize. My little cassava. They come in here. And the harder, I saw them the other day coming in here. The harder, you know, he's letting them pass through here, so. I have to do something about blocking the gate. I'm so sad. I'm taking home an avocado that we ate here. This type of avocado I really like. So my other avocado survived, but this one is the like the really pale shape looking avocado. So I'm taking that home. I was going to plant it today, but now that I see like animals coming in here and eating my stuff and you know in Ghana here the animals the hoarders the owners of the animals if they eat, eat your crops they're supposed to pay you a certain amount so for destroying your crops they're not supposed to let them eat your crops but I don't I'm not a farmer but those are my little trees that I've been trying to grow my little fruits and vegetables or whatever it is whatever I can is is it a fruit is it a vegetable let me know down in the comments thank god they didn't touch my lemon tree and my cashew tree and my orange trees over there but i'm now afraid to put anything down so see you guys in a bit so guys i'm ready to get some
She can make it up there, so. I'm not oh. going up on top, no. <laughs> No, um, what, what the capital has already did, I, I, I'm not sure that you can, because uh, it's not easy. No, it's not easy going up there. So guys, I'm going up there to show you what the guys did. Uh, These guys, they work hard. Mm -hmm. And they are doing a good job, I must say. They work fast, they work efficient, and they're doing good. So, guys, let's go. Let's go and check. Are you going? No. <laughs> <laughs> so the carpenter too is also here to finish it today. So the carpenter has finished the steps. So guys, this is the steps. How can Kenza be climb this? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Alright, I will go. Guys, finish laying the pipes. So, so this is where the toilet will come. You guys. Job. And the carpenter team came here this morning to, I mean, to co cover the edges. So this one is light. Yeah. They did a good job. So guys, this one, this this place is a bedroom. Yeah bedroom and we have washroom inside okay so this place is going to be a hall this place is going to so when you land then you enter the hall so i mean all right no problem so when you land here there will be there will be a, a, a porch here there will be a porch here you can land so here is a hall so there's another bedroom here. Bedroom. This place, this place particular is a kitchen. This place is kitchen. And that side is going to be a bedroom. So the kitchen and the hall is open. So everybody can have access to the kitchen and the hall. Okay, so let's say this one gate, I mean the door will be here. The door this bedroom door will be, will be inside the hall. And this one this one dot will be inside inside where the where the kitchen is because it's, it's going to be open so the kitchen is open so everybody have an access and guys guess what they have balcony so this balcony is for them everybody can come here and use it but aside this balcony each person have balcony let me show you guys there's another balcony here there's balcony and I have to be careful guys the rod and there's another balcony here too another balcony here too so so this one this one the washroom is very big big so I mean toilet will come here the basin the basin and the shower toilet will come here and the shower okay 
so this one this one right there is emergency fraud one. Yeah, this one is emergency fraud in case when you are when you, when you are in the kitchen and there is any water to oh, you don't you don't need to mop this right there it's going to be emergency fraud and this one is the the basin the washing and those stuff yeah, they, did a, they did a good job and the electrician too also finishes work it's a good work finish it so guys we move we move keep on moving we're going fast yeah. so the carpenter have to finish it today so that by monday or tuesday we can able to cast it up and we start the nest Whew. I'm going to get down again. Mm -hmm. oh, God. So guys, yeah. We thank God we made it. Mm -hmm be able to go and come back so they did a massive job so i'm giving the the camera everything to kenza babe so that she will continue well guys today is probably not going to be a long day for us because my pond is gone i'm not going to plant my Yams it until I know my land is secure because these cows coming at me and eating my my harvest my my um so super shoddy is going to take the ashes and put them on the ants you moving it to the ants right you moving it to the ants area he started this fire to burn the trash and to get rid of the ants so then the grass has I had some there yeah. no over some more yeah, yeah. so hopefully they go on away and don't come back did you put a lot more on that, that pile where the trash was? Right there, we had a lot. Yeah. So this is how he is getting rid of ants. These fire ants came and took over our little shed. They're gone. They're gone. Let's go, 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 let's go